Okay, hello. Uh, I'm doing another underplayed champions episode today. Uh, Nocturne, uh, jungle. Uh, he's not particularly underplayed, but I wouldn't say he's overplayed. I don't really see many of them around at the moment, and um, I consider myself kind of good at him. He's you know, he's probably my be best jungle, but I don't jungle too much. So yeah, uh, no idea how this game is going to go, but you know, hopefully it won't go horribly. But yeah, um, just smite and flash on a nocturne. You don't really need exhaust. You got your fear, and I'll just be going through, um, you know, how to play him, what to build, etc. You're kind of an initiator, although um, initiating isn't exactly your strong point. You're just a bruiser, really. But yeah, good strong jungler. Are you gonna start your uh, Q first? Uh, standard jungling start. Cross over. Um, your Q, uh, let's go through that. So, does damage in a um, line in front of him um, and leaves a trail that gives him a movement speed buff when he's on it. It will also uh, make enemy champions that are hit by it leave the trail. So, it's really good for chasing and ganking. Yeah, I played Shivana last game. <laughs> Thirty seconds until minion spawn. Anyway, um, Nocturne is a uh, pretty good jungler. Uh, he's got good, good clear speed, good uh, ganking, and uh, he's got some late game damage if you build some. That is, which I will be, but uh, that's optional really. And then he's also quite tanky, although he will he can't easily be bursted bursted down, so do be aware of that. You can easily start uh wolves as nocturne. Your passive is good for sustain as it's just AoE lifesteal that does damage. Both little walls are taken, but uh, whatever. But yeah, you do you get more life steal depending on how many uh, enemy units are around you. So you just do that in the middle of a uh, minion wave, and it's quite nice. Anyway, it looks like I'm getting a smite this ball here, which is always good. Yeah. Okay, and that's blue. Um, I normally start my E first, just in case I uh, want to do a level 2 gank, because I never really know if I'm going to have to do, do that or not. And that's just my fear, so um, just basically puts this thing on them that um, if it remains on them for 2 seconds they get feared and deals damage. So yeah, it's all good. Obviously my masteries and uh, uh, just normal tank uh, jungling ones uh, with some AD, uh, AD runes. Let's see if I can just uh, see what's going on here. Yeah, not much. Oh, um, yeah, he's warded. Uh, don't really know if that was worth it. It was kind of risky, but I'm too scared to go in, so I suppose it's fine with him. Anyway, just passing through here, I'm going to go down the walls. Spot lane's really pushed up, but I tend to avoid uh, ganking bot lane as a jungler, as they always ward. It's just kind of a waste of time. Your um, W is your spell shield, very useful, saved my life quite a lot of times. Um, but it also passively gives attack speed, and attack speed is very useful on turn as it decreases the cooldown on his ult every time he um, auto attacks. So yeah, I think I could uh, get a gank off mid now, so I'm just going to have a go at that. Yeah, he's really pushed, although he has watered here, and I know that. So yeah, you probably if you can land your uh, Q, then you've pretty much got them, but uh, fear and first blood. So yeah, not to, as you can see, he's a powerful ganker. Uh, help from Mary as well there for landing that charm. I kind of messed up my queue. I didn't really know where he was going, so um, I just decided to block off his path there. 
Anyway, just gonna go back to farming and uh, I'll do ignore like sky messages and steam messages throughout this so I can't be bothered to tab out and like sort that out. Anyway, just gonna take red now. Um yeah. You wanna max your Q, then your W, then your E. Let's like top once a gank. Okay, go on top. Just uh, pinging to tell her, I don't think he's warded. No, he hasn't. Okay, let's go. Fuck this guy. Okay, uh, can Nidalee pick up the kill though? Don't think she can. Okay, that didn't go well. <laughs> um, yeah, Vladimir's OP anyway. That, whatever, it's fucking cool. What the fuck, bot? An ally has been slain. Okay, it's not looking brilliant. Anyway, on your first back, you probably want to just start building your um thing. That one. Um, <laughs> I usually tend to get um this thing here just on my um attempt to as my second item because um I'm gonna build it into a static shiv later and it's always good to get gold five items early as just more gold as you probably all know anyway we are kind of behind uh, although Ari has the advantage I might I might be in counter jungled by an Amumu I am I'm insulted but uh maybe we can catch him out here yeah we, where we yeah we can okay nope well he burnt the splash Come here. Looks like my special came in use there. Oh, another thing I did forget to mention. If you do successfully block something with your spell shield, then you um, get more attack speed for a few seconds. So that's good when you're initiating, just to block the first thing that comes off and then have that nice damage boost. Especially when you stack attacks, well not ta stack, but when you have a few attack speed items, it can really go well, because this is all percentage. Gonna attempt a ganking bot. But I can never usually do it pre-6. Uh, we all know not turns ultimate, I won't have to go through that. But yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna take golems actually. I tend to avoid golems as junglers because um, they deal a lot of damage. But you know, I'm not turn. I've got smite. I can easily take them like that. But yeah, now I'm just going to give blue to Ari. Not turn isn't a very mana hungry jungler unless you really don't go for ages. Unless you really go for ages without recalling. Anyway, by the looks of things, if Ari had a bit of mana, she could uh, burst that Mordekaiser down. Okay, just gonna go to Wolves now and uh, probably think about going back. Because I do have that uh, some money. Yeah, I'm gonna go back after Wolves. Got my ult now, so I'll just get my Avarice Blade. Uh, team is fed. Although, yeah, like I said, getting Blue without Ari to kill him, that's all good. Anyway, so I got my ult now. I'm gonna go bot. Got some crit I've got some damage, some form of damage. And, uh, yeah. Maybe if Ari comes bot we can deal with this because uh, Moom is leaving lane now. Yeah, at level 1 your ultimate is not turn isn't very good, I'll admit. As a long cooldown, short range, doesn't do that much damage. But it's good for ulting over wards, it's really useful for that kind of stuff. But yeah, as you can see, tiny range. As you can see, tiny range to. Um, compared to what you get at level 3. Ok, 
Okay, I don't know what's going on with Barry there. Uh, I want to ult, but Mumu's got his ult, and uh, I'll just wait a bit. Okay, I'm going to take Golems. Stay close to bot lane in case I can catch them out. Um, yeah. But yeah, uh, Nocturne's fun to play mainly for me because um, he's just a good bruiser who can fit in a lot of damage, crit strike, and etc. Um, his ultimate's really fun if you can use it. Um, a nice uh, addition with the spell shield to test your timing. It's fun. Um, and yeah, he's just kind of all around good. I don't see much disadvantages to Nocturne at the moment. Of course, he's not the best. But no one is, so yeah. Yeah, bot lane's too push for me to do anything in the uh, top's recalling. I think I'm gonna do dragon maybe? If bot's pu if bot's pushed up, I'll have a look. I mean a Mumu can a Mumu solo dragon? No he can't, okay. I reckon we should have go at dragon. Obviously dragon's like the oh, wait a minute. Maybe I can uh, get a kill on Mordekaiser there. The okay, I don't know what's going on there. I'll just invade Mumu. Not turns good at uh, invading. Oh, oh shit, I need to save Ari. Counter jank ganking. You're all good for doing that. And uh, away I go. Unless Vladimir comes up now. I don't know it, what it is, but I may be experiencing some- oh shit. Okay, I'll just uh, do that and get away. Yeah, I should, I should be in the clear now-ish, maybe. We'll see. Yeah, I'm good. That was close though. Yeah, for a minute there I thought I was experiencing some lag, uh, there's a low response time with the clicking, but I think it should be fine. Anyway, I'm gonna get my uh, Wriggles now, uh, don't need any more pots, just go War Dragon and uh, can, can, yeah, continue clearing. But yeah, we got a kill out of that, so it's all good. Got blue buffs, so may as well use my Q to get around faster, haven't got boots yet. But if you're not going to upgrade your boots anytime soon, then there's not really much point in getting them as, you know, they've been nerfed heavily. Are you getting tired yet? Um, okay, I'll just go in bot now. Is it just me or is Alice is surprisingly squishy? Okay. Good old by um, Misfortune, just didn't have enough damage. Ari is fed though. Yeah, when you're jungling, it's always nice to have a uh, mid laner just help out with the ganks. I will uh, assist Morde in the defense there. Uh, if we can just chase Mordekaiser away, then I reckon we can take Dragon. Yeah, he's just gonna get out of there now. Fear the nocturne. Just uh, gonna get help from bot lane here. Ari might be able to come down. But uh, I I don't know where Mumu is at the moment, so um, hopefully he shouldn't be around here. Hey, did I almost spell shield that? I don't know. Oh, that was brilliant. That that was brilliant. I'm gonna go back in now. I'm liking that. Okay. I'm dead, but uh, I set up the kill. It's it's okay because I set up the kill and the dragon. Hopefully, um, for that, yes. But yeah, so that was definitely worth it. As not turn, you'll find you'll die quite a bit to help other people get kills, but. You know, most of the time that doesn't really matter. Unless, like, you're in solo queue and you just want to look good, then, uh, 
As long as you're winning, you know. By solo queue, I meant normal games, not ranked. Just pull that one through. <laughs> anyway, uh, now I've got my boots. Um, what to get now, I suppose. Uh, should I stop? No, I'm just going to save up for my merc treads, actually. I always get merc treads as not turn because you find you do a, not, a lot of initiating. Um, and they're just good boots for most champions, really. Makes you a bit tanky. Yeah, once you get to level 11 as a Nocturne, then you'll find that your ganking ability, if laning phase is still going on by then, really improves because um, your your ult will just, it's, it's wonderful. I'm going to ult into Teemo. How did how what? I I I don't I didn't really see there, but I don't really know how uh, she got the kill. But oh well. I haven't gone top like once this game. I should. Although uh, mid looks tasty, so we'll see. Sorry, building. Sorry, building correctly. Ari's not building correctly. I'll have to shout at her. Hey, mod. Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. That was bad of me. I was a bit cocky, but I didn't really expect a Moomoo to jump out of nowhere there. Yeah, okay, top may have to wait a bit longer. But I got my Motrads now, so I can get away around much faster. Anyway, now that I've got that, I'm just going to build my static shiv. Um, because I've got some tankiness from my uh, Riggles and my Motrads. And uh, yeah, I can just fit some damage in there as not turn. What am I doing going bot? Okay, actually, my CS is quite behind and I'm on free. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get red buff, wraiths, possibly wolves, give blue to Ari, and uh, then I will go top. I will. Um, just a general problem I have as a uh, jungling is I never seem to go top. And looks like I have to save Miss Fortune. Who? Yeah, okay. Oh, I've had my ult right now, but maybe I can flash in or something if I don't run into a team mushroom. That was silly of him. Ah, oh, fucking Teemo. Ah, fucking... Okay. I will do it. I will go top. Ah, oh, but now Vladimir's mid. Rawr. Anyway, so hopefully by now you can see that Nocturne is very fun, but um, a lot of his stuff does uh, start to kick in around um, late game, mid game. Early, early game he's not that strong, I'll admit. Um, but yeah. Probably a good idea to remember that you do have procs from your wriggles. Anyway, I could probably um ult in possibly on top. Mid later. Um I don't know. Hey. I'll just be leaving. That was bad, I didn't realise she was dying that quickly. But yeah, whatever. Yeah, uh, I admit I'm not the best Nocturne, and this isn't exactly one of my um, best games either. But um, that's okay because Ari's fed. <laughs> but yeah, uh, hopefully you can get a a better idea of Nocturne than through my bad play.
Serac is dead. No, no, she's not. They are pushing quite hard, but I think it's kind of even at the moment because we also got Dragon. So, um, not much going on there actually anymore. So, I'm just gonna take uh, Wraiths, maybe help Harry out with the push in the uh, top, which could be good. No, mid, rather. Um, and then, then if we push top as well, two easy lanes to push, then yeah. Well, I mean, not mid so much, but definitely top. Because no one's ever bothered to go there. Nah, I can't do anything. Hello. Yeah, um, just, uh, I can't do much here, but, you know, it doesn't matter, because Ari's so fed. I can't spell Abyssal. <laughs> It's not working, Ari. You could be completely raping with uh, 8 0 2. Don't you just love the people like, you know, forget the builds that work, I'll just build whatever random shit I see. Kind of wish I uh, saved the uh, thing for that now. Spell shield, that is. Yeah, that's the lifestyle I'm talking about with your passive, it's really good. I have my ult now, but I need to go bot. I can't, I'm not gonna go there actually. Oh wow, she's just too good. No mana to ult, that's always good. I'm just gonna take Wolves and go, cause she's clearly okay maybe, possibly no, okay. Hopefully that should scare them off, I'm not actually prepared to go in. Remember that, uh, the passive on your ult, fuck, she's dead, okay. Anyway, remember that the passive on your ult uh, removes their vision, so just pop at the start of a team fight, even if you're not going to go in, because it can really help. Ah, oh, that turret, I'm just going to go up there and take it. I don't know why Nidalee went back. There's one, one more auto attack, that would have got it, but okay. Uh, um, yeah, now I can get my static shiv. Now, after I've got a bit of damage and a few people flame me for building AD carry, which I'm clearly not because I have Mercury Treads, we can get a Frozen Mallet. Um, Phage is wonderful on Nocturne, and I should have built that sooner, but I completely forgot about it, so make a mental note that Phage is good. AP, Teemo, AD carry, okay. Alright, anyway, I'm finally level 11. Uh, yeah. Yeah, look at the attack speed. It's brilliant, because you get most of the damage out of your passive, and so, yeah, it's all good. Not to mention you're building AD anyway. Now, I think, I just think, they might be doing uh, Dragon, which they're not, so let's do Dragon, because I have some Hello, Dragon. I was a bit off my smite there. Yes, yes, we know Soraka. 
What is Timo doing? Tempted to flash, but uh, my Q has sorted things out. That ult. Just as long as we keep hitting him. What? Come on, Ari. Finally. Okay. Fucking hate Teemo. Okay, no CS for me. I'm gonna take our red, just clear out our jungle. Let everyone else get the uh, CS in the lanes. Or have my jungle taken by Misfortune who has a bot lane to CS, but whatever. Junglers have to put up with this shit. Anyway, so yeah, just maxing up my um, W as it, you know, just gives me more attack speed, more, more attack speed. Uh, not to mention, attack speed also charges up your um, shiv faster, so that's good. Alright, my ult's up, so we can probably initiate soon. Hmm. Oh, no. Um... They're initiating. Pop my ult just for the uh, lack of vision for them. And they full on raped. Ow. Okay, that did not go well at all. Like, fuck, that went terribly. Your team has destroyed a did, did we even get one of We We didn't even get one of them. Not even the initiator. Okay, let's just go in and uh, not stop them from getting the inhibitor. Or stop them from getting the inhibitor and kill Mordekaiser, it's all good. Yeah, clean up time. I'm gonna go top. Maybe split push and uh, not kill him because of his sustain, don't like him. But yeah, um, I think the reason we lost that team fight really was just because of Amumu. I mean, Amumu jungle OP at the moment and uh, no one really likes him. Yeah, um, I know the lads around there somewhere, so I won't go up to the turret and push it. Well, actually, it depends how much health it has, which I can't remember. But uh, I'll at least push out this wave just to uh, apply pressure. And uh, yeah, so actually, no, if they're, some of them, they're all mid, so I can get this turret. Um, maybe, we'll see. Yeah, I'll get it. I've got my flash as well, so um, worst comes to worst, I can just do that. Okay, hello. So, yeah, he broke that fear, which is never good. Fuck, that was actually quite good of him. Okay, I'm dead. That always just, uh, I don't know how to deal with it. 
probably would have been worth it if I've got the tower, which I really didn't, so maybe it was just stupid by me, I don't know. Anyway, I've got a giant spell now, and uh, I should be dying less. I'm kind of the team's only tank-ish person, so yeah, everyone's quite squishy here. I mean, our top lane is niddly, so yeah. Sometimes if you have a really squishy team, you may want to just skip the static shiv, or at least delay it a bit. So um, you can just make sure you're, you're that bit tanky, because they are so much tankier than us. I mean, yeah, they're much tankier than us. So uh, Norton has good pushing power like that. Anyway, I can you can easily solo dragon because of your own life steal and stuff. So I think I'll do that now. Actually, a team fight's about to break out, so I'll just have to go uh, mid. No, it's not. Okay, back to dragon. It's placing a ward there. If you're a better jungler than I, then you'll buy warm wards and stuff, and Nocturne so can easily afford that, seeing as he has really good clear speed, so, um, yeah. I'm not saying Nocturne's the new OP champion or anything, but I'm definitely saying he's fun and you should check him out. Because, I mean, his ult is just brilliant. Okay, Chima Shrooms. At least uh, you don't have a need to carry, but uh, we're still losing somehow. Just rape the kind of AD carry. Anyway, we definitely won that team fight. Um, yeah. Getting out of that. Okay, yeah, that went much, much better. I suppose the other time... Yeah, they just kind of... Uh, had a bad initiate there, we just went in. I mean, not turn as the ability to just jump on anyone that he wants, so whoever's fed on their team, just run in and kill them. So that that's another reason he's actually very strong in team fights. Um and then the map vision that is just taken away um when we just threw not turn. It's really, really useful. I mean like, occasionally if the enemy team isn't as skilled or experienced with a not turn They'll just panic for the next two seconds, wondering, um, um, uh, uh. But yeah, that, that went really well. I can go back and get my Frozen Mallet now. I'm going to be really tanky and have some damage. Okay, um, uh, what bot next? Next you, it depends really. I need to build relatively tanky. So I'm gonna get a Randuin's. Or, no I'm not. No I'm really not. I'm gonna get a more Mammortius. Because uh, it gives me more damage. And it gives me the magic resist I really need right now against uh, people. So, yeah, let's build that. But yeah, if you weren't, if you needed more armor, then uh, you want to get a Randuin's because not uh, stacking a bit of health on Nocturne is also very useful. But fucking hell, what? Anyway, sorry. Um, but also, yeah, stats are also good. Okay, I got that kill. It's good. Okay, my ult's at level 3 now, this is the part where it gets OP. Like, the range is insane, the cooldown's only 100 seconds, which is a brilliant improve, um, improvement from the first. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I, it, it does fuck ton of damage as well. So, late game not turn is very strong when you get some items. I mean, I actually have a lot of gold, my CS is good, uh, I have a lot of assists, it's just I've died a few times, but that's because I'm an initiator, and, uh, 
like I've said in previous uh, streams, I'm not the best initiator. So, normally initiators aren't meant to die, but I do. So, that's, people are just going to have to live with that. Ah, <laughs> oh, fucking Teemo, why does no one have an Oracles? Why is he placing him in the middle of the lane? Why? We want a Baron? Yeah, we can Baron. I'll just uh, place a ward over here. Oh, okay, I'll place one. Uh, wait. Yeah, hey! Okay, my ult's up, so, um. Yeah. But the way your ult works with spell shields is you'll still be. You'll still uh, go to them, that you just won't deal damage. So, yeah. What? Where did that come from? Where? Yeah, if, isn't that more of a support item? Yeah. Okay, um... Kinda wanna go in here, but kinda don't. If that makes sense. Okay, our minions are pushing a uh, bot, so we'll just get that. And uh, catch out Mordekaiser? Or not. I think I'll tank this. Look at the look at me melt that. Okay, so uh, I suppose we'll just go back mid now, because I said so. And as you can see, Soraka had the same idea. Just gonna not kill him, but you know. Uh, Ari got the kill instead. Uh, your W is good for face checking as well if you don't know what you're gonna run into. Yeah, if you thought you could juke me, you are wrong. Soraka, you didn't really need to flash, but okay. But yeah, he's dead. Now watch as the kill is stolen. Almost stolen. But yeah, I don't really know if that was worth two flashes, but whatever. Okay, I almost finished my more now. So um, yeah, that's great. We've got more magic resist, much more damage. And uh, I'll just be invincible. More man Mortius is a brilliant item on Nocturne, I'd recommend it in a lot of situations where you need magic resist. It'd be nice if our support had built a, um, oh wait, no they have, okay, uh, ignore me. I'm gonna go top, just push that out, maybe get the uh, turret, you know, deal with some unfinished business. Actually, Baron's a good idea now, because uh, Teemo's over there. Just 
nuking this guy down. They don't even know yet, although Mordekaiser is on his way. But he's dead, so it doesn't matter. Yep, and that's how that works. No, fuck the bot fuck bot lane, let's just get the turret guys. They can't they can't hear me, but whatever. Fine, I'll keep the pressure on here and just get the minion waves. What the fuck was that flash? Whoop, yeah. <laughs> Love Ari's charm. Just gonna focus on the turret while everyone else does all that shit. And uh, yeah, kinda rape them there. Could win here, but I'll, I want my Mortius. And I'm gonna die. I might die. I don't want to die. I'm gonna die. No. Oh god, no. Fuck, oh, 50 health. Okay. If I didn't have the extra magic resist there, I would have. Yeah. Here, I got my more now. Uh, what to build now? Fuck it, Bloodfuster. Oh, uh, Ari has a good point, though. Afraid of the dark. Pushing, yay! Tempted to use Joe top and kill Teemo, but uh, I think I'll kill this wave, then kill Teemo. Teemo must die. Nope. And I'm out of here. God damn it, I just want this. Reckon I can tank this turret if, everyone, if everyone's going for it? I reckon I can. Okay, looks like we're gonna win here. Don't know what my movement is doing. Pop everything, we're gonna win. Okay. Uh, that was a fun game, hope you enjoyed it, and I uh, hope I showed you that Nocturne can be fun, and you should definitely have a look at him. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching, see ya.